Create a Windows 10 Boot Media using Media Creation Tool. To create a bootable media, connect a USB flash drive of at least 8 GB of space, and then use these steps. Open Windows 10 Download Page. Under the Create Windows 10 Installation Media section, click the Download Tool Now button to save the file on your device. Double-click the Media Creation Tool file to launch the tool. Click the Accept button to agree to the Microsoft terms. Select the Create Installation Media, USB Flash Drive, DVD, or ISO file, for another PC option. Clear the Use the recommended options for this PC option. Select the correct language, architecture, and edition of Windows 10. Select the USB Flash Drive option. Click the Next button. Select the removable drive from the list. If you don't see the drive, click the Refresh Drive List option. Click the Next button. Click the Finish button. Once you complete the steps, the tool will download the required files and create a bootable USB flash drive with the Windows 10 installation files. Once you've created installation media, you'll need to insert it into the PC you want to install Windows 10 on. Set your computer to boot from USB. At the Dell logo press F12 multiple times. On the Windows Setup screen, select your language, time, and currency format, and keyboard layout. Click Next to continue. When you see the Activate Windows screen, you'll need to either enter a key or skip it. Select the operating system you want to install. When you reach the Which Type of Installation Do You Want screen, click Custom to perform a clean installation and remove everything on your PC. On the next screen, Select the hard drive you want to install Windows on and erase it. If you have multiple partitions on that drive, you may want to erase those as well. When you delete a partition, you're also deleting all the files on that partition. Be sure you have backups of any important files before doing this. When you're done erasing partitions, you should have a big block of unallocated space. Select that, click New, and once it's formatted your drive, Click Next. Windows 10 will install itself, and may restart a few times during this process. When it's done, you'll see the normal setup interface you see when setting up Windows 10 on any new PC, where you can add user accounts and adjust various settings. Select Region. Select Keyboard Layout. Set up for personal use. Offline account. Limited experience. Create a name. Create a password. Confirm password. Create security question for your account.
Thanks for watching, don't forget like and subscribe. Help me make a dream of 100,000 subscribe.